Hello and welcome. This video is brought to you by the StreamingAdvisor.com. Tailor your entertainment with streaming. And you might be wondering, with the new Plex Media Center, does that mean that the Plex Media Center on the NVIDIA Shield can handle channels? It does, though there is not a way to add them in the Plex app that I've seen. I tried to go in and see if you could open the Plex Media Center via, like, the apps down here. Just go, you know, went through, actually, and that's running apps. So I did try this. I'm just going to show you because people are going to say, well, why don't you just do blah, blah, blah. People love to be armchair quarterbacks. See, we have the Plex and the Plex Media Server. And if you open Plex Media Server and tell it to open, which, where you might think you might find folders, it just says... You can manage the Plex Media Center using the Android application. So, you know, you might have seen my other video where I looked at that and I saw nowhere specific to add channels. Though you see that I do have channels on here. And before I go into how to add them, I'm just going to show you that it does in fact work. Like this is the CBS, obviously. Go to Prime Time, Two Broke Girls, Full Episodes. And we'll just go to this one right here. You see it pulls up your interface here. And you say play. And this is playing from my server. I'll show you that this is on my server. Or I mean it's playing on the server from the NVIDIA Shield. Don't. Alright. There you go. Here's our... There's my favorite girl, Cat Denning. Okay, so, just uh, for the sake of it, I don't want you to think that I'm leeching this off of, say, my PC or something else. So, we're going to go into Settings, and you see, this is my Shield Server Android TV. You know, I can switch to my laptop, which has a lot more stuff. So, we're going to go back in here. So we have the Shield Android TV server selected, and right now we have three channels. How did we get those, you might ask? Let me show you how. It's not too tricky, but you will need some other device. In this case, I'm going to use my computer. I'm going to go ahead and let's get that open. And See. All right. So, what you want to do is go ahead and go to the Plex home screen, and you want to sign in to your Plex account. If you've never done that, it's simple enough. You just go to the right-hand corner, and it'll say "Sign in." It's a nice big orange spot. I'll show you where that is. I'll sign out and let you see that in a second. But first, I'm going to show you how to actually get to your TV shows and stuff. So, you see that there's a menu for Plex's server. And we've selected my Shield Android. Again, this is the PC. This is the laptop. This is my Shield server. So, we're going to make sure that that is selected. If you do have multiple servers, make sure you go to the drop-down menu and select the right one. Next, you go down to where it says Channels. And you just click on it. And it will open it up. And this is the channels that you saw installed already. You go over here to this little orange button here. And you click Install Channels. And that's going to populate this channel directory here. If you want to figure out what kind of channels you want, best bet is to go into categories. And this pulls up, you know, a whole bunch of them. Now, for some reason, while I've been working on this this evening, it's been a little wonky. I don't know why. It's just been a little laggy. But we'll try to demonstrate it right quick. So I'm going to go to, like, when I added ABC, for instance, I went to TV. And you, you know, go ahead and click on it, 
you got to give it some time. You got to give it some time to load. I said, don't ask me why it's taking everything so long, but it is taking a while. But you see that it pulled up the channels. And now we're just going to add a couple of things. Let's add NBC. And, and keep in mind, this is installing like over the web, but it connects with your server. It's, it's really pretty cool that way. It's syncing everything. All right, NBC is installed, and we'll put in a couple of other things just to show you. So PBS. All right. And I think we're probably pretty good here, but, you know, we'll just, for the heck of it, also install USA Network. So now what it should have done was install these channels onto the server connected up to my NVIDIA Shield. So let's see if it did. All right. So we're back to the NVIDIA Shield. Plex. Look at that. It's already there. USA Network. CBS, ABC, NBC. Now, I'm not sure if every single one of these apps will always work because sometimes things work differently in, you know, like, on different platforms. Don't ask me why. I couldn't tell you. But we'll just give it a shot. No episodes. USA is very based on what's new. No episodes. Oh dang it! What's on AS? What's what's on a USA Network right now? I might give up on this one real quick. No episodes. And let's see. No episodes. Okay. Forget USA. USA works very well in season, but apparently it's not going to cooperate with us right now. Is episodes of Thirty Rock? Making me look silly in front of the kids, guys. Of course, you did see CBS work, so. Hey, hey, there we go. Okay, so we'll just click Project Reborn. And again, hopefully this plays and I look like a genius. Come on. Play and make me look like a genius. Come on. Yay! I look like a genius. How about that? <laughs> okay, so that you know is just another example. That's an app that you can add. But that's how you add the channels. At the moment, I've seen no way in the settings or anything else to add other things. I haven't ha I haven't seen a way to go in and you know access the channels the way that you can with something like the Plex Media, like the Media Center on the PC or even some other Plex apps. Pretty much the only one I've seen that really lets you do it is the Roku. We'll have to see if you can add channels with a Roku and then put them on this server. That would be cool. And that might be possible. So that is how you add channels to the Plex Media Center that is on your NVIDIA Shield. Now, I'm sure you're asking, well, what about the unsupported app store? That's something I haven't had a chance to take a look at, but I'm making these videos almost in real time because they just got the server up tonight. But we will look into that, and when we find a way to do it, we will let you know. Till then, I hope you found this helpful. I hope you will subscribe to our channel and help us break 7,000 this week. That would be awesome. When we get to 10,000, I might just do something goofy like sing on camera. I love karaoke, and we might just have some fun. So, for the Streaming Advisor, I'm Ryan Downey. Stream on, my friends.